I'm gonna do a quick, quick tutorial on how to mix glitter into your resin. Um, this is not gonna be a cool design. It's just gonna be one because I'm testing out this mold. Um, but still, I thought this was gonna be a good tutorial. I already did two for you guys, and I'm doing some awesome colors. This has blue plus silver in there, and these are the first layers, so they're not thick. Tomorrow morning before work, I'll do the next layer, and then when I get home, I'll do a follow-up video of the end result. I'm going to do three colors. I have this glitter here that I'm going to mix, this glitter here I'm going to mix, and this glitter here I'm going to mix. Okay. Oops. I should have opened them all because now I'm one-handed. I didn't think about that. Uh-oh. I'm going to turn on my light because the glitter really shows really good. There we go. Making some awesome colors. So what you do is you just tap some in a little bit. Um, I actually have a little spoon that I can scoop some in, but... Oh man, I'm making a mess. I shouldn't have done that. But... This one is a poor one, so it wouldn't make sense. But the spoon's actually good to use, too, because with the ones on my little container, I have one time dumped all of them out, even though they're new. I had them in an old container, and I dumped a lot out and been very mad at myself. But the piece came out, especially these ones. See, like, right now I just poured a lot out. So, basically, I'm going to grab my popsicle stick, a new one, because the other two are full of resin. And I'm going to just mix them very lightly without causing bubbles. So, you don't want to just, like, swirl up a mess. And I'm thinking I'm going to pour some more of that light pink. Because this one's giving a cool effect. I'm not quite sure what the background color is going to be though. I'm thinking like my um, confetti one. That would be awesome behind them. It would be like bling bling. I'm thinking I'm going to add a little purple on there. Sorry, I'm trying to turn this thing with one hand. These are the ones that have like different colors in there, and I love these colors. Okay. And again, I'm just going to mix it in very lightly without, like, mm, making bubbles. Why I'm trying not to make bubbles is because you can't see the bubbles now. And tomorrow, when I pull it out, I'll see the bubbles. Okay. So I think that layer is mixed pretty well. I'm loving the colors that that's making. I would add a little black to it, but I, th I think I would ruin it because it actually came out a cool color. This blue one I'm loving and the black one I'm loving. So that's my tutorial. Oh, and a new, new cool thing I recently just purchased yesterday that I showed you guys is these little containers that I purchased. And remember I told you guys I love these. I 
I love these pack of glitters. Why? Because you get so many colors for like a good price. And I can test them and see which ones I like. And those are all my little ones that I have gotten received. I purchased, I think, like maybe like two packs. And then I got for a gift. Because my cousin said I was like obsessed. And so my friend bought me as a gift. Like three, so... Yeah, I didn't purchase all of these, but gifts are awesome. I'm thinking of buying another one, because I think I'm getting more glitter in, I hope, from a friend or a trade. And then also, I just did that one. That one's cool. I'm thinking of doing the back rubs with these like that. I'm not sure yet. So, I'm going to go to bed, because it's really late, and I just wanted to do a quick tutorial. Thanks, guys. Bye.